Japan's new administration under Prime Minister Shinzo Abe is working on transforming its energy policies. The trade minister says the country will continue exporting nuclear infrastructure after ensuring that it's safe. Japan has accumulated technology and human resources related to nuclear power. We would like the chance to put these to peaceful use. Meeting partners' requests and ensuring safety will be the major premises of this effort. And we also want to keep exporting our nuclear power infrastructure. Japan has been promoting exports of nuclear power generation facilities even after the nuclear accident in Fukushima. The previous administration, led by the Democratic Party, has signed pacts with countries such as Vietnam and Jordan in 2011, enabling it to transport nuclear technology. Motegi's comments suggest the new government is willing to follow the previous government's policy. Nuclear power representatives from around the world have met in Malaysia to discuss energy in Southeast Asia. The region needs a way to fuel its rapidly growing economies. About 300 government and corporate officials met in the capital, Kuala Lumpur. They talked about the advantages and challenges of introducing nuclear power plants. Malaysian and Indonesian officials say nuclear power remains the main option for growing economies with high energy demands. They say that this is in spite of strong public opposition after the Fukushima disaster. Both the officials stress the importance of guaranteeing the safety of nuclear energy.